Hi, I'm Michelle with Tennis Warehouse, and today I'm gonna to teach you how to keep score in a tiebreaker. As we've talked about before, the scoring system in tennis is a little confusing, so hopefully this video helps keep it simple. Let's say you and I are playing a match. A tiebreaker begins when the set score reaches six games all to determine the winner of the set. The tiebreaker is played to seven points and the winner must win by two. Think of the tiebreaker as a game. If I begin serving the tiebreaker, I will serve a single point to begin. Then you will serve the following two points, one from the odd side and one from the do side. We will continue to switch servers every two points and switch sides of the court just as we would in a game. Every six points, we will switch sides so everything is fair in terms of the sun, the wind, the court slant, etc. We will play up to seven and the winner must win by two. And once that's determined, that's the person that wins the tiebreaker and wins the set. One of the biggest questions we often get asked is once the tiebreaker is over, who serves the first game of the following set? This will help keep it simple. If I serve the first point of the tiebreaker, then you will start serving the first point of the first game of the following set. Or another way to look at it is whoever served the last game before you went into the tiebreaker will serve the first game of the following set. Hopefully this video helps you understand the scoring in a tiebreaker. I suggest getting out on the court and practicing it so it will become second nature the next time you have to go play one. Now if you have any questions about playing a tiebreaker or scoring a tiebreaker or anything tennis related, be sure to visit us at Tennis Warehouse, Tennis Warehouse Europe, or Tennis Only.